So we're just going to go ahead and hop into the first girl. So who want to go first? Oh, she bold with it. Ooh, I will. Oh, we got us a little firecracker. Nobody popped their balloon. So, you know, go ahead and uh -oh. um, shut everything up. Hey, my name is Nevaeh. Y'all can follow me on Instagram at Nevaeh Marie. Oh, she don't play that. Nobody popping. Okay. So, do you... <laughs> so... Because he was trying to be funny, but it's okay. What I do? No, not you. Oh, not me. Tired. So how do you Google. how do you feel about fifty fifty? Um, it, that's fine. Like if you need me to do fifty fifty, that's cool. Mm -hmm. But like, a man gonna take care of you. Okay. What she say? If you need me to do fifty fifty, that's cool. Mm -hmm. But like, a man gonna take care of you. First things first, right? Now, I didn't get excited because. I long to do 50-50. No, I'm taking care of my woman. Whole heart. I want to, man, what? You my woman, you showing me what? You got me? I right. straight. No, you ain't got to worry about no bill. Save your money if you want to have your business. You can work, do what you got to do. Bop, 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 bop. If you want to be step, do you. You feel what I'm saying? You know? But a woman that don't mind if she needs to, is a lost art out here now, bro. She actually, hold on. See, I'm a real reactor, bro. I'm not going to sit. I had my pre med. I, 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 I ain't going to lie when I saw her. I'm like, oh, yeah, she want to go. Yeah, let's uh, see. Hold okay. on. Let's hear some more. Um, what is your ideal first date? Um, Something fun. I'm so sick of dinner. Like, that's so boring. Like, let's go to, like, Top Golf or K1 Speed and do something fun. You know what I'm saying? What? What? This why you don't. Okay, see? See, even your boy sometimes, I'd be like, off the appearance, I'd be low key, I'd be like, oh, wait a minute, she might, she, her energy, you know, the way she looks, she might not, you know. That's why you gotta let people talk first before you have your premeditated assumptions about them. You just assume, you already think about, oh, yeah, I know how they. You don't know. You don't know. I didn't know. You think, I, when I looked at her, I'm like, oh, yeah, she wanna go to Maestro. She want to go to Roof Chris, steak 48, medium well steak, butterfly cut, butter, buttered potatoes, shrimp on top, asparagus, lobster tails, endless mimosas on a brunch with the Obamas. You know what I mean? <laughs> but she cool. Time. So any of my fellas, y'all got a question? <clears throat> you said what? How, how, how old are you? How old are you? I'm 19. <laughs> Look, I'm 23, my baby. I'm not going to lie. I stopped mine at 18. I'm not going to lie. Like, when I turn 24, I'm going to bump it up to probably like 20. Even though I don't put too much age on it, I just feel like anything in teen is like, like 18, that's that's a no-go for me because you just was, you feel me? 19, depending on your maturity level. You feel me? You know, you're grown. 19, you've been, a, you, you know, 19. Like, that's so her. I'd be cool with it. You feel what I'm saying? She turned 20, I turned 24, four years apart. I'm 30, she's 26, 34, she's 30. So that's not bad. You know what I'm saying? Um, Her maturity level's there. I wouldn't pop my balloon. I'm not going to lie. Damn. 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 I got kind of scared. Damn. Now it depends on how old they are. Now if they like 27, 28, and they don't like that nine year gap six seven year gap cool but like anything under five about five and below you should be cool i got hot as long as you ain't 23 and she 18 or like 17 and you 22 you know what i'm saying you got one okay so uh, if you pop the balloon go to the bottom and my two guys come to the top for me right quick some of them pop their balloons but they be in my dms hello so you guys can no longer pop y'all balloons okay um you got any questions you want to ask them um, how old is you? 19. Say it one more time. 19. How old is you? Same age. Now I gotta pop day balloons? It's up to you if you wanna oh, pop a balloon. Put my balloons out. I like unk them. Oh, you like unk them? Right. So you like 35 plus? Hell no. <laughs> you dragged it just a little bit. My you dragged fault. it just a little bit. My bad. So, you didn't find a match. <laughs> my bad. I'm sorry. This is the only problem I had with that, right? She showed a level of like, okay, she tied it there, da, da, da. She, she got some experience and maturity. You could, you could tell, obviously. You didn't give a chance. You should have asked them a question, asked them something, figure out, pick their brain. 
because up them obviously you know what i'm saying they they don't they value you know it's, it's different i just we got to keep watching oh, we on to how up them react you know thanks girl we see how up them react. whoever want to go next b19 Hey y'all, it's Erica from CLT. That's Erica with a K, CLT with two T's. Okay. Um, before we get into this one, shout out to UV Gallery for the jacket. It's tough. Yeah, it's, tough. it's tough. You feel me? Got the Bumblebee for the free. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got a scat. I got a Lambo in the front. Y'all know. Y'all see the Lambo. So you know what I'm saying? So um, any of my guys, y'all got any questions for? Say that one more time. Charlotte. Okay. You want to know what side? What high school you went to? I went to, I graduated from Olympic. Oh, oh shit. Well, that didn't matter. He wasn't attracted to her. That The fact that she graduated from Olympic does not matter. You're not attracted to her. You just didn't want to pop it off the initial attraction level. Instead of being real, you picked some very minute that she graduated from a high school. That doesn't define her, her character or her morality. Just be real off the rip like the other ones did. Pop, you're not my, I'm not attracted to you. That simple. You ain't even got to disrespect. I'm not attracted to you. Why, why you pop? Why you pop? Um, I don't really know too much. About exactly. At Olympic, but I do know that they say, like, you feel me? You ain't supposed to, like, deal with people from over there. You know? Who said that? Who? What's the source? Just say you're not attracted to her, bro. Okay. So, I ain't never heard of that. I, grew up yeah, I never heard of that, right? What? So. I don't know. I'm yeah. I I heard that one. That's fine. I respect it though. Um, yeah, no, let me think. Let me think. That. What's up? What's up? She know how to cook. Yeah, I do. I got a daughter, so she got to eat. Oh yeah, that's where you you feel me. But we like to eat out too. So don't get me wrong. I spend a little money on okay. some food. So whenever you eat out, do you expect the guy to pay for the whole meal? Mm, it depends on what the relationship is. Y'all in a y'all been in a relationship for a year. Yes. <laughs> What if, like, you mean, like, what if he don't got it? Like, yeah, yeah, like, what if my if car, like, what if if my car declined? If it declined, then I got it. Okay, what if it keep declining? <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> then I'm going to ask you, I'm going to be like, babe, what's up? Like, what's what's wrong with the money? What's what's going on? We're going to have to sit down and talk about our finances. That's dope. Right, let's okay. Go. Let's say, let's say, uh, um, a f uh, um, nigga got, like, a, a kid. You have a kid, too. You know how, like, females don't like niggas with kids? That's not true. Not for me. I think that's that's I mean, cool. I don't got no kids, but I just had an ex. You feel me? Yeah, I I seen that going around. I don't I don't believe in that. I mean, part dates, play dates, cool. Okay, so you guys can no longer pop y'all. Oh, what's up? I got one more question. Okay. Um, you said you got a daughter, right? Yeah, I do. How old is your daughter? She's five. How old was when you had your daughter? I'm sorry, I've been in your business. I was 15 when I had my daughter. Come on, bro. Like, what is that, bro? She has a daughter. She was 15 when she had her, bro. Like, if y'all was going to pop it because of the age she had her daughter, you didn't care. You didn't like, bro, come on with this, bro. Like, I ain't going to lie. Stuff like that low-key kind of irritating, bro. It's like, come on, bro. You went this long and then, oh, I was 15 when I had my daughter. Like, okay, man, she would have had, oh, I had her last year. Pop, pop. That's too recent. Where the baby daddy? If she had a daughter when she was 15, she's probably like, what? It's probably been, what, seven years? You don't know. I don't know how old she is. That means the, the daughter's well-aged. You don't got to be no crazy step. Like, it's more, it's much more wiser to have somebody with a little bit like an older, not even a toddler, not a baby. You know what I'm saying? Because you ain't got to change. They're older. Like, that didn't even... <laughs> they don't know the background, though, but it's yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm about to say that. They don't know the story. Okay. So, you're down to one. Though. So my boy decided not to pop his balloon. He's the last one. I might give you the opportunity to ask him a question. Okay. Um, let's see. I know you're a fun guy. You, you're about your business. You're going up. I'm proud of you. Um, what's something that someone doesn't know about you? Like, I guess, yeah. Mm. You said you what, brother? Be open. <laughs> um, oh, no, I feel like I'm pretty open about myself. I feel like I don't know how to hide nothing from nobody. Okay, that's a good answer. Okay. Um, you got any more that questions? Mean, that means he confident. He confident what he do. Mm -hmm. And what Jocelyn say? What she say, y'all? I don't know. What, what Jocelyn say? 
<laughs> no, <laughs> she wasn't afraid of what she do. <laughs> yeah. Tight. Tight. So, um, it's up to you now. Are you gonna pop his balloon? Or are you gonna find your match? Or it's, what's up? I'm not gonna pop my balloon. You see him? Oh. So okay. So let me go ahead and hold that for you right quick. Look like, look like we find ourselves a match. I go ahead and clap it up for the first match. On to the next one, no cap. All right, bet. So let's. I thought he was ending the video. I'm finna say, dang. That's a cold way to do a little ending. Sound like outro music. I'm like, what's up with? I'm gonna hop into the next girl. Who wanna go next? Tight. Okay, go ahead and shout yourself out and everything. My name is Sheila at Is That Sheila and Tony on all social media. Okay. Um, you look like you got a question, my boy. Do she like kids? Yeah, I do. Like kids? Okay. Um, if you get in the car with your man uh -huh. and he picks up his mom, are you going to the back or are you staying in the front? I go to the back. Okay. Humility. I like how she humble about it. I'll go to the back. My mom's the type. My mom's. My, I feel like I, I know I'm a great guy because of my mom, bro. My mom is a very respectful and amazing woman. Of course, everybody had their issues and problems, but my mama is a morally. She's a morally inclined woman, and I feel like that's why I respect all types of women. But I respect a woman with morals because I saw my mom, bro. Like my mom, really. I see my mom, bro. Her and my dad. Quick little backstory. Her and my dad split up. You know, none of y'all business. Anyway, but they split up anyway. Uh, the reason why is not any reason. Y'all you know, get what I'm saying. And, but I've I seen my mom for a decade, literally not bring another man in the house. No man gave her no money besides my, you feel me, my pops. Uh, no man ever, no man ever, um, she never slept with no man. She never, she worked for her own stuff. She she was always very, you know, respectful, wise, get her money, took care of her kids, took care of her business, put God first. And I saw her do that. You know what I'm saying? And I found the respect for women because it's like, you know, they could be so strong. I know I went to a whole nother, like, like a moral woman is so strong. Like, it's, it's not easy to be a moral woman. It's not easy to, your moral code of conduct can be very, very declining as a woman. Because you're beautiful, especially a beautiful woman. You know what I'm saying? Because a guy is, oh, you ain't got no money, you can't make rent. Oh, yeah, go ahead, let me get, let me hit that. Your rent be, I, I, I let it go six months. Don't worry about it. Just open your legs up. More women. Oh, you tripping. It ain't that deep. It ain't that serious. I'm not finna open my legs up for no... Nah. Moral code. Moral code. I'm not finna take no $2,000. Nah, I know you ain't good for me. I discern your spirit. You ain't a good good. You ain't a good dude. I see my mom. You feel me? You know, I, I seen it. You feel what I'm saying? And when I say receive my money for my dad, I'm talking about when, they, when, she gave, when he gave her money for us, for me. And my sister, you know what I'm saying? Mom's was working hard. I seen it, you know. So that's why I was like, I like, you know, with, with that question, moms would be like, "Nah, it's okay, son. Let her sit in the front." You know what I'm saying? Or you know, cause I'm the type now. Nah, mom's in the way, you know. But the type of mama I got, she man, what? She good sit in the front. There ain't even no problem. Moms don't even think like that. We kicking it. My girl or my wife? Your girl. Oh, I, I, I just had to make sure. Okay. okay. What about your wife? Oh, nah. What if what if he was his wife? I mean, it don't matter. Okay. I ain't picky. It's just a seat, right? Yeah. You know, you know. Social media makes that. The same place. You feel me? At the same time, tight, tight, twinkle, twinkle. Um, how do you feel about it on the first night? Nah, it ain't happening. Moral code. Moral code. <laughs> <laughs> it's not happening. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. Now it don't. He thought he was for to have a group with him. He popped and walked off like, <laughs> I, hey, some people, hey, some people. Determine like anything, but sometimes, you feel me, if it's the vibe there, the vibe there, you feel me, you got to rock out. You can't wait till the second night. Yeah, I can wait till the second night, but damn, I already popped my shit. Yeah, yeah, you out of here, my brother. <laughs> damn, okay. Any my, uh -huh. what's a What's a good first date like you would want to go to? Like a good first date like? Um, An escape room. I like that. Okay, I like That's that. That's how you know y'all got to talk to each other, you know. You, you see the key to get out? Oh, so, uh, any of my fellas down there, y'all got any questions? You beat up niggas? Oh, say, say that one more time. You beat up niggas? No, <laughs> no. I'm going to leave. I'm going to be gone. 
So my fellas, y'all, oh, we got one more question. Two more questions. Come with me right quick. We got three more. What's your um, ethnicity? I'm black. You just black? Yeah. And what's your goals? Why you? What made you pop your balloon? Bro, bro, I'm not racist. Or I'm black, my damn self. <laughs> you is not black, little bro. No cap. You you not even mixed with like a little bit of Hispanic. How you black? Tell me. Who black? <laughs> Who black in your face? I'm just light skin. Light skin? Yeah. That's light skin. He black. That's <laughs> <laughs> stupid. <laughs> okay, bet. So yeah, what was your question right quick, Jay? Oh yeah. Uh what is your goals? Like like what is your goals in life? Um start a business, you know, have kids. What type of business though? Esthetician. Background. You know, have an LLC my own thing. So like what are your traits? Like what are you good at? Makeup, hair, you know. Look how he looks. <laughs> I want to know what's he what he thinking. I'm just saying because what if I might want to invest into you and I'm trying to see what type of yeah, qualities and goals you got. Esthetician business. All right. mm -hmm. Okay. Hold on, I had one question. I had my fault. Oh, I was going to ask. What do you do for work? I work for the city. What you do for the city? Customer service. What's customer service as in? Communicate. Front counter. What you mean, like, you a receptionist? Yeah. Receptionist? Mm -hmm. Is that really what you do? Yup. It's giving, it's giving up, but. They must know her. They must know. They must know she has something in the closet that she doesn't want to reveal. It has right to now. Bro. <laughs> okay. The one, the uh, next question we had, he popped out. Another pop. Follower. Follower, follower, be a man. Let your balls hang. Like, what's wrong with y'all? Let your nuts hang. Be a man. Don't tuck it when everybody else tuck it. Let them hang. If you like her, you like her. <laughs> <laughs> he said she been lying the whole time. That's all, too. all my fellas, y'all scoot down right quick. <laughs> so, now my fellas, y'all can no longer pop the balloon. Well, he got a new balloon. Didn't he pop? No longer pop the balloon. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to let you ask him a question. Um... Okay, y'all on the first night or what? Y'all are y'all doing <laughs> on the first night? My bad. <laughs> first night. You yeah. said what? Like, are you gonna allow us to? <laughs> <laughs> or like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I wanted to. <laughs> yeah. Would you? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Hell no. For oh, sure. Uh, yeah, for sure. Hell I'm a virgin. No. This guy. This guy. <laughs> you got any more questions? No, I don't have any more questions. So my fellas, um, I ain't what's your ideal first man. date? I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't hitting on the first night. I haven't done that in my life. And I had a girl literally pull my pants and pull my pants down and was ready to get crap. Nope, nope, no. I'm cool. Uh, uh. I don't know you enough. You got all these diseases out here and all this stuff going on, and you talk about the first night. I don't know you. Kind of pop, not me. Now, I, oh, I slide out. I, I, now I'm gonna grab something that's gonna stay with me forever. Hell, no, 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 I got to get to know you more. It's, it's, you got to think about it, bro. It's so ties to these things, bro. Y'all got to understand. It's a, lot, it's a lot of spiritual stuff that goes on when you have an intercourse with somebody, bro. They feeling down. You might have sex the next morning. You you wonder why I ain't. Why my energy so low? Or why I'm thinking this type of way? Why am I feeling this way? This is something new. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what they dealing with. So emotional connection is deeper than just getting that, getting that, getting that nut. It's, it's, it's bigger than getting that bust. It's bigger than that. You know what I mean? It's bigger than that, bro. It's 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 it's, it's bigger than that, bro. You ever hit somebody? Boom. You know you been even your girlfriend. If she had a bad a good day, she come home. You get boo boo boo. Next day you wake up. You feeling good? Like oh, it feel cool. Yeah, that's energy. Y'all transferring energy. We going to our gallery. First night. 
I'm a fun person, so I like to do fun shit. You feel me? It ain't mm -hmm. even got to be no crazy shit. Okay. Let's go to church for the first date. Let's see how you are around the, uh, around the, around the righteous people. Just <laughs> might do like okay <laughs> escape room shit like that. You me? Why you? Why you, wait? Nah. Why you roll your eyes like that? Because, because I said what? that. I mean, that's what I like to do though. Okay. You feel me? Type. We're gonna do like amusement park type shit. Mm -hmm. Tubi in the car. <laughs> so see, I'm boring. We could just nap. Nap. Okay. Okay. So um. It's up to you now. You can go up to the. You can. I need you to eliminate three guys. Cut it in half. Let's cut it in half. Uh, dude, what did you say? I said two in the car. Netflix. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> <I> said Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> so we're down to the last three. So now I need you to eliminate two of them and choose your match. Unless you got one more question you want to ask me. Me a oh, okay. That's the last two. How old are you? 25. 25? Yeah. Okay. You? Nice, eh? <laughs> um. Boom. So it looks like we find ourselves a match. Let me go ahead and hold that front. Wait, do you accept? Yeah, I said. Let me hold that for you, my brother. Y'all go and join it tight. Let's clap it up for him. Yep. Yeah. Hmm. Like, comment, subscribe. I love y'all, bro. I don't know, man. I'm not gonna lie, yo. It's like this. Like, with me, bro, it's more so like, all right, how old are you? All right, I, I can see the question if it's like, all right, I'm gonna pop your balloon because you're way too far off. You feel what I'm saying? I get it. But if he 19 and you like top of your 20s, come on. Ask a moral question. But then I got to think about it. This is just for content. You know what I'm saying? I be forgetting that. Like a lot of this is literally just content. Like, all right, let's just get out here, make this dope content, go viral, get, get some laughs or whatever. I be coming into it thinking, they really try to find love. Like, I be tripping, bro. I don't even know why I be even, you know. Um, uh, you know? Go eat some, uh, um, go get you some beet juice today. It's good for your, uh, your blood. And if you have problem with your sling, it, 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 it'll have you on sergeant. Go get it together.